Well, that's a good question. I don't know. I bet I probably try to keep it mentally separated on paper, but, you know, it's tricky when you're doing creative things. It's good to work for another artist who kind of understands that there are, you know, busier times in the shop where I'm there a lot or times that are less busy and I can work remote or just work fewer hours. Um, and, you know, there is definitely some blending primarily because I do a lot of letterpress printing in my work. And that's really because I have access to Dan's shop and I'm able to make work there. So, you know, because I have had access to those presses for the last 12 years, that's really informed a lot of the way that I make my work. Um, and, you know, I didn't graduate from RISD making a lot of text-based work, but because I'm surrounded by letter forms all day, I really have gotten a lot more comfortable with using uh, text in my own um, art practice.